Hello, my beautiful spiritual family. I'm doing a really deep dive at the moment in my intuitive mastery school into relationships and ultimately responsibility. So there's a lot of people who attend my clinic or come to my classes and are very spiritual and conscious and just doing their best to show up uh, as the best version of themselves that they can be. And a lot of them have partners or loved ones that are not, that are not doing their spiritual journey. The question then becomes, who's responsible? Am I responsible for the whole relationship? Am I responsible just for myself? Or do I need to have some level of responsibility over them as well? The answer is we only can ever be fully responsible for ourselves. Everybody else has the sovereign right to show up or not. And I know how difficult that can be when we have partners, lovers, good friends that are suffering and we really want to help them. But I've learned the hard way that it's actually not our job to fix that. It is their choice to choose whether they want to become more conscious and work through their pain or whether they want to stay in it. Now, we can sometimes put seeds in place and sometimes that works. But what I've found to be far more potent is holding the energetic space. And what I mean by that is doing your own work, loving, forgiving and accepting yourself at every opportunity when you feel like you're in dysfunction or when you're not functioning as well as you would like to and be the light, be the change, be the vortex. And that becomes an invitation in and of itself.